Good morning. I am Sachin Ranmali from Faculty of Medicine, University of Colombo. Uh, my research topic is hand grip strength and risk of falling in children with visual impairments. Introduction. Globally, 2.2 billion people have visual impairments, majority of them are in Asian countries. As well as uh, when they have which they have a vision, they get many information from tactile sensation used by their hands instead of visual information. So uh, previous studies have found prolonged experience of visual impairment, light touching main cause in uh, changes in muscle properties leading to changes in hand grip strength. As well as previous studies have proved that impaired hand grip strength causes to higher risk of falling. So, uh, hand grip strength and risk of, uh, risk of falling in children with visual impairments was very beneficial for children with, uh, for their day-to-day -day activities. Methodology. Uh, I conducted my research as analytical cross-sectional list study uh, and I recruited 45 children from deaf and blind school, children with visual impairments and 45 sighted children from Moruto Mahavidyale according to the randomized, systematic randomization. And uh, their age range is 11 to 18. I measured visual acuity by using Snell and chart. Their visual acuity was uh, children with visual impairment, in children with visual impairments was uh, 12 by 6 to 0. And it was about 6 by 6 for children, sighted children. I used a uh, hand, uh, JAMA handheld dynamometer for measuring handheld hand grip strength. Uh, I measured uh, them uh, it uh, one by one uh, with uh, seated is position they are seated position and uh, I used uh, hand interview administered questionnaire for measure risk of falling uh, results. The first graph shows how they get uh, hand uh, is is go for handheld dynamometer uh, according to the graph. Children with visual impairments had lower hand grip strength than sighted children. The difference was significant. And the second graph shows uh, how they get a uh, score for questionnaire. According to the graph, children with visual impairments had higher risk of falling. Uh, so conclusion, imp children with visual impairments had impaired hand grip strength and higher risk of falling. So introducing muscle strengthening program and balance training program would be very beneficial for children with visual impairments. Thank you.